we interrupt our regularly scheduled Fierce program for a very special segment. It's the biggest sporting event of the century and we're bringing you full coverage of every second of action. It's no stretch to say that Trixie and Katya are the most legendary rivals in the history of sport. I don't wanna look at you. I don't wanna, I don't wanna look, look at you. you. I don't wanna look at you, you're so close to me. While they face off, you need to put your face on. I mean, hello. These two queen size 12 pan palettes stick the landing with flying colors. I am not around here. I'm here on official business. That's how you, that's how you know I'm wearing a, an official business lady blouse. We're here to do something I do best, which is disguise <laughs> salesmanship as entertainment. And the entire collection of cosmetics and merch is a perfect 10 with bonus points for style. The Team Trixie and Team Katya collections launched this Friday. I'm wrecked. Why aren't, Why aren't you wrecked? wrecked? Hi, it's me, Trix and Mattel, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm a world famous drag queen with a passion for makeup artistry. And this is Katya. Woo! Woo! I'm here on very important business. And these, um, I know those fans. Oh. What? <laughs> Do you want to fix it? I, I guess I should. You know what, why don't you go fix that and I'll let them know what the tea is. Hi, Trixie Mattel. This collection is becoming available Friday and make sure you hit subscribe before that person comes back because this channel has tons of exciting free content all the time. So make sure you follow. Uh, the collection we're gonna show you guys today is incredible. It's the biggest thing we've ever done. It really is amazing. And like, I'm just gonna say it before she comes back. I couldn't think of a better person to do this with. She constantly inspires me. Okay, she's here. Did you fix it? We present to you the Team Trixie and Team Katya palettes. Oh! Oh my God. Bob, you expected perfection. Guess what? Your expectations were exceeded. Look at the metallic. Wait, let me do it too. Yeah. Isn't it beautiful? It's helpful. I'm, I'm sorry, excuse me for one moment. Look at the coordination here with the look. Mary, look at it. And let me tell you something. I don't give a shit enough about makeup to do something shitty. No. If I'm gonna do something, it's gotta be perfect. And guess what? <gasps> yes! It so this is. is on the heels of about a year later after Red Scare. Yeah. Which makes an appearance in this collection. These are the Team Trixie and Team Katya 12 pan pressed pigment oh. palettes. Meaning you can use them on your cheeks, eyes, mm. skin, all over the place. Put them in your hair, live your life. You can use it as a phone. You can sell it as a, a chocolate bar to the neighbor. You can whack an assailant with it. There's a lot Works of- as a remote. Change the channel. Oh, darn this stuff. Let's give the children what they want. Okay. Oh! I get so sorry. excited. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry to this man because that's all you need. So, okay, my my motivation in creating this palette was I wanted an all-in-one. Mm -hmm. I'm a utilitarian kind of girl. I, I like to have everything all in one place. And this is everything I need. And I'm gonna tell you, I did my eyes with this uh, palette. You're gonna die when I tell you that I did not use the black. I didn't even need to dip it in the black because that brown was so deep and rich. The brown is lit. I have the some of that on too. The brown is so deep and rich that it did the crease and I smoked out my liner on the bottom with it. I cried out in joy. You cried out? I, 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 I don't think I have to explain myself anymore when I say that it's a perfect time. Do you want to walk us through the color story? This palette was created first of the two. Yeah. What was your process? Okay, with the theme, I figured I wanted to do gold, silver, bronze. I love metallics. I just like bold jewel tones. High bold. Autumn, yeah, high bold. Falling into fashion with autumn shades. And of course I need a highlight. I need a nice like blue, like a cheap whore or a pink cheap whore. Day into night, whores. <laughs> All the variations on whores. <laughs> Let me focus for a second. We've got certain uh, gymnastic terms here that deserve explanation. I don't warm even up. know the meaning of something. We gotta warm up. You gotta warm up. I'm gonna do this watching oh. today because this person's covered in tattoos. I'm covered in tattoos. I'm no longer this fit is for warm competition. Up. In hell. And who this, is she? Who is she? She's on the lid, honey. Clock the lid. She's right there. She's on the lid. Yeah, this is a primary red matte. It's also really hard to find a matte vegan red. Talk about it. It's hard to find a matte vegan red that has any f***ing pigment in it. Yeah. And she blends. She blends. Now then when you've, um, you've warmed up and you've completed your routine, but the judges give you a terrible score, guess what? It was rigged. 
It was rigged. Rigor Morris. It was, it was rigor Morris because a lot of times when a sport is based on aesthetics, it's really it comes down to opinion and impression oh. and bias. But look at that. You can't you can't fight the moonlight with that shade. You received um, a low score. It was rigged. But in that routine, guess what you did? A laid out somersault right here. A lovely tan. This is beautiful. This is a creaser. You want to create? Uh, she blends oh. any cut. Oh. She'll blend the red. She'll blend the bronze. She'll blend this deep rich brown. She kind of does it all. It's beautiful. She's a contour too. What's that nose? You want to will it down? Laid out. <laughs> That's pretty much exactly what I would do with it. Exactly. And I have to say, I love fun colors, but if a palette doesn't have neutrals, I'm probably not going to use it that much. Well, exactly. I'm lazy. Yeah. One, two, three, four. What do you call those? Neutrals. neutrals. Yeah. <laughs> It was rigged. I did the laid out somersault. And what do I get? I gotta move on to bars. I gotta chalk it up. You gotta chalk it up, mama. Yeah, the flop. <laughs> now it is skin colored. <laughs> so, so listen. It's a disappearing it's, it's, eyeshadow. For Ooh. it is a Caucasian flesh tone for very pale um, types like myself. I use this as my highlight, and over a primer, it completely disappeared onto my very pale skin, and that's exactly what I want to happen. Because I don't want my highlight to be white anymore. I've moved past that. I remember when I went to, when we went to Drag Race, they gave us those tips. Don't wear too much white and don't wear too big of eyelashes. And I was like, I guess I'll stay home. I literally was the only one who followed those directions, by the way. And so I showed. had these teeny little woman lashes on and you know, it looks like this. Oh, I love that there's a mirror here. Okay. And then so so we chopped it up. We did the bar routine. It was all right. What in that bar routine uh, wowed the judges? It was the Shapushnik of a half turn. That's where the pink comes Sh in. Is that how you say that? Shapushnik. I've been saying Sharapova, which That's I know is a wrong. tennis player. I do know that. <laughs> also, it's Sharapova. This is beautiful, by the way. I know. Hello. <laughs> it's so pretty. I have this on Look as a blush. Look at the pink. I have it on as a blush. And I wanted, I want to alert the crowd to the fact that you're just putting this on your mushy, shaved dusty, arm. <laughs> shaved dude arm. I shaved this arm and not this one. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. It's like the neighbor. That's just, that, that is, is so really horrible. scary. This looks like you got Frankenstein. It's bad. It's really it's bad. It's really bad. It's really bad. Well, you know what? I'm a bisexual stream. Oh, Do you want a hand nightmare. job from the guy yeah, or the girl? Nightmare. That is so beautiful. I have it on a, like a cheek color. I just buffed yeah. it so Oh pretty. yeah, oh I see that. I Hot pink is one of the most like universal, easy things mm. to keep. It's just, it's great. Even though you really, uh, you had legs together in beautiful toe point on the Shapishnik of a half turn transition, you were underscored. That's tough. You were underscored. Silver medal. Just shy of the gold, but look at this. Look at the payoff. Look at the payoff. <gasps> oh my God, something to be proud of. I'm sick of commentators saying she lost the gold. No, she won the silver. She won the really silver. You lost the gold, f you. You're number two in the, f in the world. world. Yeah. But guess what? I gotta go get a wake up wipe. Okay. I really need you guys to know about this. Now that the, my boss is out of the picture, I am bargaining for vacation time and some sick, uh, uh, oh, oh, she's back. Hi. I swatched the pink straight over the nude shade. See, it, it, it's in the Invisible Man. You know, I don't, I don't differentiate between the cameras and the world. I know. For me, life is always dull. a show. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Life is always a show. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. You're I was in, always <laughs> born. When I was in acting school, we had to read that book. Ex wait, what? Acting. <laughs> I have a BFA in theater, bitch. Oh my God. How dare you? Often. Where? What do you mean? Where? What do you think I went to school for? I don't know. A small when I was engine in acting repair. School. Oh. No. Uta Hagen's book, Respect for Acting, yeah. she talks about being natural on stage, and mm -hmm. she said, think about it. Whenever there's an animal in a play, she said, I was in a play where there, I think she said a stray cat ran on stage, mm -hmm. and it was so compelling because animals perform like no one's watching. And that is how <laughs> cats started. Jennifer Hudson said, let me get on that face app real quick and show you something. Can we do the other six shades? I think we could. So, oh, would play here. her. Who would be the three? <laughs> now, one of them got covered. The nude got covered. But I actually right. have the nude on my lid. So if you want to know. No. Let's work backwards. So I need a brown so rich, mm -hmm. so deep. That's where the flip-flop comes in. <laughs> oh, you're not going to the left. You're no. starting here. I love it. No, I pivoted. I actually have this on on the outer corners. Yeah, me too. All this, by the way, all these colors in this palette. And today I chose this one day to do the most neutral makeup I've ever done. I know you're a f idiot. This color is so pretty. And by the way, black swallows your eye very quickly. Yeah. And this is so flattering it's, and gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that deep, oh. rich color. High point coffee. It's decaffeinated. <laughs> so pretty. <laughs> I have enough energy, thank you. I have enough energy, thank you. I could not lie. <laughs> I enjoy my sixth cup of coffee as much as my yeah. first. I've got enough energy, thank you. Thank you. you. <laughs> 
Thank you. Like, she's like, shitty about it. Why is she about it? Lauren McCall is such a dick. Because she is called Lauren Bacall is such a dick. Let's just get the fuck out of my limo. I don't know if she's living or dead. I don't think she watches this channel. <laughs> that's so no, that's I wouldn't true. worry about it. So then we've got um, Yurchenko. Yurchenko is a style of vaulting that was made famous by a former Soviet gymnast. Gorg. Yes. Oh, it's like a denim, a metallic denim. It's so, it's such a great blue. And it's a wonderful shade to be complimented or buffed out with the dismount. That's how you stick the landing. I That's how you stick the landing, honey. Love this color. Yeah, great on the lid. We did a shade really similar to this mm. in um, daytime realness. Look at look at the finger. Oh my god! Even before it goes, ah, oh! get into this. Tell me you don't want to shove this all up. Oh! Your ass. Oh! Yeah, up your. Ass. That is so. Up it's like um. Spread. Cool chalk. Spread. The judges would not give you a score. They would just say, spread your cheeks. I'm going to shove it up your ass. Both gymnasts uh, in training would definitely be doing lots of planks, which is our next color. A lovely shimmery purple. Gorgeous. We actually have not Fantastic. done a shimmery purple, I don't think. I know. It's hard to find a shimmery purple. Oh, oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so pretty. It's purple, but it has like a pink, like a rose it's shimmer. Like a, yeah, it's got like a, she's got a lilac thing going on. That lilac is princess. That, is, oh, that yeah. is beautiful. It's Gorgina. And of course, we're gonna go back to black with amplitude. Black is a, a very used color in my palette. It's a slimming eyeshadow. It's, yes. Black is a very slimming eyeshadow. Yeah, a lot of pigment. <gasps> It's a lot of, um, get a lot of mileage out of her. Also, not a lot of fallout. Black is really tough. Oh, the whole palette though. I was shocked at, so I, I was unfamiliar with using the palette, obviously, because I haven't had it for a while. Mm -hmm. So I powdered a ton underneath my eyes, yeah. just in case there was a lot of um, fallout. There was no fallout. Last but not least, of course, we have, inspired by Simone Biles, the goat. The goat, honey. The greatest of all time, the gold medal. You know, I did also not know in, why you were calling it this until now. Are you f I was like, okay, diva, goat, oh. gymnastic goats, yeah. down at the farm, goats. It's so embarrassing. It is embarrassing. But, you know, I trust people's artistic processes. <laughs> Who am I to invite you to do a collab and then tell, I you, mean, tell you what to name things? Yeah, you, I mean, gee, if you didn't edit my Shepashnikova, you wouldn't oh. come for the goat, and it's oh, beautiful. beautiful. Okay, I just need you to look at it. I need you to look at that arm, that nasty arm of beautiful color. We are missing this chalk it up because, because it's, it's flesh colored, but it is there. Yeah, it's it's very, it's it's pale Caucasian flesh colored. Great for a highlight, a tip of the nose, whatever, if you're fair like me. Beautiful, I, beautiful. I love the palette. No, I really do. They, I well, actually I'm, I'm do. Well, also, okay, let me tell you something. A lot of celebrities these days are full of shit. They're big, they're big dickheads who um, will just, will, they will say anything to get you to buy some podunk piece of shit garbage. But I am not that kind of girl. I've never have been and never will be. So I had to test all of these shades over and over. I rejected many of them, but I love all of these colors and I approved all of them. And if you don't like it, cause you have no taste and you're full of shit and you should be disqualified. Someone lied to her several times. Yeah, the judges or your coach. By the way, if you guys have shot with us before, it's the same size pans as um, Plant Gay. So it's a very similar Which is size. a great palette. It's 12 pressed pigments in a beautiful palette. And we decided to flush out the story even more by adding a companion piece. Whoa! The Team shit. Tricks palette. Uh. I guess it's really a rival because once we decided that this palette was almost gonna be like, this idea that it's like a Russian gymnast who's yeah. going for a world title, we were yeah. like, well, who is her competitor? Who's the Amer- who, Where's the Cold War? Yeah, and maybe what's this like happy American kind of vibe? Yeah. They're rivals. I mean, they're rivals. It's like um, Rambo and, um, not Rambo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Rambo and Lauren Bacall. <laughs> like Rocky IV. <laughs> oh, oh <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? So these shades were meant to be a completely different vibe, but these shades were meant to be used with this palette. Yeah. So even though they're enemy palettes, they have something in common. Yeah. Their love of goats. <laughs> Their love of goats. Because people who don't get along often yeah. have things that they see about each other. Because that's well, why I hate yeah. you. <laughs> so let's get into here, shall we? One, two, three. Oh. oh! So the story for this palette is a little more Lisa Frank goes to the Olympics. Yeah. If you guys look at the campaign images of the video, I'm in this dramatic, crazy teal eye that was yeah. using this. Gorge. A lot of pastels there. Lot, don't ask, don't pass still. Yeah. I'm gonna get up close because I need you guys to see the design. There's like all these little graphics of gymnasts and athletes. I'm gonna swatch on this arm so y'all can see. So the first shade is Game Face. It's a ballet slipper metallic, very pretty. 
it is close to my skin tone, yeah, so you yeah, guys yeah. don't see it, but it's yeah. like a very opalescent rose gold. Mm -hmm. It's like the color of uh, tights. Oh yeah, it's ballet, ballet tights. pink, yeah. Next up we have Get a Grip, which Ooh. I love. And I don't think we've done this yet. This is like a Stacy pink metallic. We haven't done a hot metallic pink. No, and this is where the rubber meets the road because <gasps> this is, she goes lovely over Shepashnikova. She bang. You know what I'm talking about? Spirit Fingers. Spirit Fingers is a soft pink. Look how pretty that is. That soft baby pink. You don't taste that shit. <laughs> that shit in your mouth. <laughs> that is so pretty. It's really pretty. It's just, I love soft baby pinks because it's a great way to do a neutral lid color that warms up your eye a little bit. Also, babies are fun. To who? I want to eat them. This is a heavy metal. <laughs> Which is kind of like a gold medal, but this one's just a little more. Just a little faded. It's an the star who's had it, who had her day. The Ooh. shade is really meant for like a tear duct moment, like clean yep. skin, then yep. just like. Yep. I love when people are really beautiful with nice skin, nice lashes, and then just the inner eye. Like this? Well, I said really beautiful with nice skin. <laughs> the shade is called Perfect 10 yeah. Gorge. Yeah. This is a biodegradable glitter. This is similar Ooh. to the glitter that we had in Plant Gay, mm -hmm. which Developing this, this biodegradable glitter shades, mm -hmm. this formula is better than non-biodegradable glitter shades. Look she at bangs, that! She bangs and she degrades. It's the color of Jasmine's harem pants. Oh, what a great reference. Yes, it's a mint. Yeah. It's so pretty. Imagine this on deeper skin, just like a floating. It's yeah, beautiful. Oh. Imagine it floating on a carpet over the Middle East. So pretty. And we have and pose, which is obviously a reference, a reference. to um, to the way my mom died. <laughs> she was posing in a dev window for prom dress season. And nobody offered her water and she just dried up. She dried up. But they moved her carcass down to Hot Topic and she still got paid to work as a mannequin. Yeah. Oh. oh! I call that a, that, I, you know what I call that? Pornographic mint. You can kind of see how they were made to go together now. Pornographic mint. When I thought of the story of this, like once you said what we were doing, I was like, mm. well, if this color story is like, th like the 16 year old at the Olympics was this like, is it's my year. Yeah, this is the veteran. This is her last year. Yeah, the veteran. And yeah. if she doesn't get the gold. <laughs> so this front shade here is bartender. <laughs> this shade bartender, I have it basically all the way around this eye. I took it on a fluffy brush and just buff. Bartender is so beautiful. It's the color. I would just want to say it's the color of like corduroys. Isn't oh, that beautiful? I was like, bartender? Why are we bringing liquor into this? Bartender? I, 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 got I got it, I got it. Because I drink. Yeah, <laughs> I know. You can see the color story coming together. Mm -hmm. This again, these are um, rivals from different worlds. But they're complementary. They both bleed for the game. Yeah, and they both know the same set of skills and they both serve the same purpose. Yeah, the shade more is called that. Stick It. This is what I have pretty much as the base color of this mm -hmm. eye. Yeah. Because I chose today with all these colorful shades to do all neutral makeup. Yeah, really solid oh. product. It's gorgeous. Oh, I love that. But let's be honest, Terracotta, honey. you buy it for the brights, you use the neutrals. Let's be honest. They're the things that support a jewel tone, um, a, a fluorescent, you know, you can't burn the building without, you know, starting a fire. All right, this is called Take the Cake. Mm -hmm. I love a maroon like this. This is yeah. such an easy way to wear like a pink without looking too flashy. Oh, oh yeah. Cranberry. Oh, cranberry. Cranberry sauce. I love it. If all you bloodshot divas out there, cranberry is a great compliment to distract from, you know. All you bloodshot divas. <laughs> um, <laughs> as a bloodshot diva, listen. <laughs> No, is this for real? All it's you right. bloodshot divas out this, there. This one goes Thanks. out to all my bloodshot divas. I, 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 no. All right, let me do my job, please. Up next, we have Champ. I think that a matte yellow eyeshadow is basically a neutral, and I think more people should play with it. Matte, like, buttercream on the lid is so beautiful. Oh, oh that yeah, pretty? that's gorgeous. Just imagine like clean lashes and oh just that on the lid. And also on like- Like deeper skin, like deeper right skin on the lid. Like yes. Topaz. Oh, this is flipping out, which um, this color is basically sourced from the color of a dolphin in a Lisa Frank palette. Okay. That's basically the vibe. This is so beautiful. Whoa. Oh, isn't that beautiful? That's pornographic mint. So pretty. Even just using it as a liner is hot. And finally, we haven't done a shade like this either. I wanted to do a glittery black. Can I do the honors? Yeah. On you? Was this showtime? Yeah, this is called so showtime. Okay, watch my finger very closely. I'm gonna just press it. Really good in there. I'm gonna do it a few times so you know it's getting juicy. Okay, stop. <laughs> oh! I'm Look sorry, Look at the glitter it. pieces. Look at the material. Look at this filthy finger. Look at all that glittery, gorgeous pigment. That's gonna go right on your face. This is the biodegradable uh, glitter shade too. Look, yeah. So this is the collection together. Look at it, beauty. It's so pretty. 
It's almost, you know, they are truly really complimentary. It's hard to imagine a world where a customer does not buy both of them. I mean, honestly, get whichever one you're actually gonna use yes. the most, but if you get them both, there are gonna be color combinations that you can only do if you have both. I have a great idea. Say you got a Russian pen pal. You buy one, you get, the, and you buy one for your friend. Do people still have pen, no. Yeah, of course. Email, do you know about email? If you slide into someone's DMs from another country, is that the new AG version of pen pals? No. Do you remember like in elementary school, did they ever make you get like a pen pal from another country? Yeah. Jail. You ever Jail? Read yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not another it country. It always got steamy. <laughs> <laughs> so take a long, hard look because now we're gonna start to show you other pieces of the collection. So within this collection, we are re-promoting two of our most famous shades we've ever done. Stacy, our bright pink. And Red Scare, our gorgeous red. Oh, I need to get a Stacy. Oh, hi. I'd also like to take this opportunity to remind you of me. I'm a person who operates independently and beautifully and wonderfully on my own, as well as with Trixie. I have certain adventures going on. Uh, in progress, in process at the moment, that you can peruse on my personal website, which is welovegotcha.com. And thank you so much. So I'm kind of running out of space here, but uh, this is Stacy, if you recall. Oh, that that's, it look, it's so, it's so pretty. It's really I, I mean, this is, that's like a runaway hit, right? Neon, It's yes. gotta be a runaway hit. Yes, this is our first a, thing we ever did. And it's it gotta be a runaway hit. I didn't know the company was gonna work. I was like, well, if we only ever make one thing, what should it be? It's, yeah. It should be a hot hit. It's a classic. We also are doing Red Scare. Do you wanna do the honors? Yes, I do. Do the back of your hands. Wow, it's Beautiful. vegan, it's matte, it's Beautiful. red, it doesn't feel dry. Mm, it's so moisturizing. It's beautiful. This la When this came out, was a year ago, the website crashed yep. because you guys really popped off. No, so. it's because I hacked into the mainframe and bought them all. We also have two glosses in this collection. One of them is a re-promote. I don't know if anybody remembers a shade called Scarlet Letter. I sure do. Thank you. You're welcome. This is a red <gasps> gloss that's made to be extremely oh, sheer, so you can just wear it. deep, rich color. Daytime. It's just meant to tint. Yeah. It's not intense. May I? So this one's made to be like, not a full color experience. This is day in and night. Oh my God, watch this. Oh. Beautiful. Look what happened. Look what happened. Oh. That's that hot. That's disgusting. Hot. Porn. 14 men in three different public libraries just jizzed at the checkout counter. <laughs> Speaking of, we have a new <laughs> gloss in this collection that basically is that idea, but in hot pink. So this shade is called Lollipop Lux, and it's a sheer hot pink. Oh, oh, that's, yeah. You could wear this just on your naked lips for a little color, or you could layer it up over something. Yeah. I'm gonna put it on over this nude so you guys can see it. Oh my God, all of a sudden. It's this and is kind just of a, like that, she got wet. Do you see how it dyes it pink a little bit? It's gorgeous. Compared to that, it's just a little yeah, bit pink. It's, just, it's a little bit pink and a lot of it wet. Yeah, we're looking out for you hoes out there who want to wear lip color, but you don't necessarily want to wear like a yeah. bright red or something. Yeah, you don't want to commit to deep and rich, but you're definitely um, into hot and wet. Or if you're wearing the palette and you're wearing like a million colors, you don't necessarily want to put on Stacy. I get it. Right. Look at this lip. <laughs> it's pretty. Can everybody just quit it? <laughs> Everybody should leave. Just shut up and go I need home. You to leave. I'll go up right now. Sometimes when I'm getting ready, I look so good that I literally look in the mirror and go, shut up. <laughs> so to recap, we have two pressed pigment palettes, 12 shades each. Can you hold it up? Oh. We have two 12 shade pressed pigment palettes retailing at $48 each. We also have two lipsticks in this collection that retail at $16 each. We have Red Scare and Stacy, And we also have two new glosses in this collection. One of them is Scarlet Letter, and one of them is Lollipop Lux. What else do you need? A bunch of uh, period pads and a, and a pack of headphones. Well, there is more things you need. You're kidding. So you guys really love the mirrors we do. And in this collection, I was like, we have to do a new mirror. So <gasps> this is the new mirror. It is red to match the Team Katya oh my, palette. I think I ripped it. Get ready for it. <gasps> isn't that amazing? Oh, isn't that amazing? Oh my God. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at it. Oh, I love it. This is the same price as all of our other mirrors. It's 26, it's just a new shade and it comes in a nice safe container so it is not gonna get damaged. Have you ever wanted to fall in love with yourself all over again? All the time. Look, I mean, look at me. Auctions, auctions, honey, <laughs> auctions. It's not only a mirror, it's um, uh, a pee-pee pad, a whack-a-mole, you're a, a judge. Per, oh, um, uh, crossing guard? Absolutely, stop. stop in the name of love. What about? Oh, no, I'm not that gay. Oh. If you're interested in getting a PR box, this collection has an incredible PR box. The Team Trixie, Team Kati PR box comes with both palettes, both glosses, 
and a hand mirror. It also comes with a photo card. And I mean, the PR box, you guys, has the most gorgeous picture of us. We did the photo shoot, the campaign for this. Albert Sanchez shot it, who is it's incredible. that girl. It's incredible. This collection has other pieces. This collection has Team Trixie and Team Katya merchandise. It'll have you show your shirt. Oh I'm obsessed gosh. with my shirt. I'm obsessed with my shirt. Oh my God, it's so, look at you, spread eagle. And look at this one. Oh, that's cute. It's very on, that's very us too. I know! That's very us. It's kind of like 80s workout apparel totally. or something. It's very Cold War. And yours is actually you with the updo from the shoot. Yep. And mine Ooh. is me, and that's my real leg extension. Yeah, and this is me putting my in the wind. And then the shoulder says, Team Trixie. Oh yeah. And, and that one says, Team Katya right Team here. Katya. That one says, thanks Obama. <laughs> If you're somebody who likes to uh, wear shirts, you might also be interested in covering <laughs> other parts of your body. We have the most incredible Team Trixie and Team Katya socks. Oh, those are so cute. You never showed me those. I know. I just put your name on things and sell it. <laughs> so the Trixie ones are pink and blue and the Team Kati ones are red and black. Perfect for people with varicose veins, thrombosis, or suffering with gout. They have a lot of scratch. I wear a men's 12 and they stretch up to me. So yeah. anybody will be able to wear them. You will look great. You don't need any pants or panties but you will attract lots of friends and mates. And finally, you need something to put all your items in. And this collection has an incredible gym bag. bag. Oh, wow. Oh, just the Trixie bag. Sorry, Flop. We were do making this gold medal thing for the photo shoot. And I was like, why don't we use this? Yeah. So it's a little zipper pull. That is so cute. It has an interior that's like little blue um, little blue hearts kind yeah. of like the inside of our packaging. Very jealous. Very jealous. Oh, you rats searching around for a food. All right, so quick recap. Once again, we have both 12 pan press powder palettes. Yes. We have Red Scare and Stacy in this collection. We have Lollipop Lux and Scarlet Letter in this collection. We've got we a lovely mirror. An incredible mirror. We have a PR kit that comes with both palettes, both glosses, and a mirror. We have tube socks. We have a Team Trixie or Team Katya ringer tee. And a yeah. gym, gym bag. bag. What else could you possibly want? We want Team Trixie IUDs. Well, I thank you for doing this with me because um, I love the colors. Yes, and I was involved at every step of the way. That's not a joke. I surely was. I, I put my blood, sweat, and tears into this palette. I'll say it's a very you palette because I wasn't exactly shocked at what you chose. I was yeah. like, this makes yeah. a lot of sense. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't trying to impress anybody. I was literally just trying to impress myself. And I'm very hard to impress. Go for the gold this Friday and pick up pieces of the collection. We're so proud of it. Enjoy the Team Trixie, Team Katya collection. It's not a rivalry. It's um, it's a it's a celebration. It's healthy competition. Yeah, because when we both strive to beat each other, we all end up doing the best. And when you have great makeup, nobody's in competition with you anyway. No. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>